Hi Gemini, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your weekly reading for April 1st through the 8th. This is for the sign of Gemini. What does Gemini need to know this week, the first week of April? First week of April, 2018, for the sign of Gemini. Positive movement forward. Okay, this is the Eight of Pentacles. So hard work pays off, Gemini. Transformation, this is the death card. So you guys are starting something new. That's going to lead to something stable and secure because of your hard work. You guys are releasing something. Starting a new journey. Going on a new path. And this could have to do with work or money. Could also have to do with a commitment. Be careful of, for what you choose. There will be consequences for your choice. Let me get this zoomed in. You guys have the ability to accomplish whatever you want. No one can stand in your way. I can. I can. Beautiful. So you guys are, are uh, building a firm foundation. Okay, you can do it. Nobody can stand in your way. Whatever this is, it's leading to wish fulfillment. It feels as though, you know, you probably have a few choices here. Okay, this is the Seven of Cups. You have some choices in regards to which path to take. But it feels as though you guys have been working really hard at figuring out what you're wishing for and taking action to go get it. It's like you guys aren't just waiting for your dreams to come true. You're making them come true. Okay, you guys are working on fulfilling your wishes. You're working on fulfilling your dreams. And you're doing that with faith. Okay, this is the Hierophant card. You're doing that with believing in yourself. You are following your own path with full belief that you can do it. It's like there's no wishy washiness here. Like, I can't do it. I can do it. This is I can. You guys have the power within you to accomplish anything you want at this time because. It feels like you guys are a power horse, and should anybody stand in your way, they would probably get stepped on. I just feel as though you guys are very strong-willed at this time. You have um, really worked hard on fulfilling your dreams, and because you're, and your hard work is absolutely paying off. There, you have built a firm foundation, and it has no chance of cracking because of the hard work that you've put into it. You guys are headed down a new path, okay, with this death card. With endings bring new beginnings. So I feel like you guys have a wonderful new beginning right in front of you because you've worked hard for it. You've worked hard to to start over. You've worked hard to begin again. And because you've worked hard to begin again, a new door is opening for you, okay? I feel like, you know, you guys... Um, are taking the next step. You're taking the next step that leads to success, okay? I feel like there's been a period of um, procrastination, or there will be. You may go through a period, or you may go through some sort of dilemma, but your inner knowing that knows that you can complete this phase and start again and go down this new journey will allow you to move forward okay i feel like you guys are taking positive steps to fulfill your own wishes and i feel like this week you will probably be presented with something that asks you to think twice you will be given a choice and one of these choices um you will really have to really consider so this is advice for you. I feel like you are going to be given a choice that could lead you astray. So really think twice. This card is the Seven of Cups. Beware of false beginnings, okay? So you could be dealing, somebody could come in and try to mess up your plans. This is advice for you to really 
think twice and choose wisely in regards to somebody that might come in and try to crack your foundation just just a heads up you know you could be dealing with somebody that you know is obsessive or maybe even jealous of you or wants to take your money or something like that okay so just keep that in mind um I feel like you will be faced with some sort of dilemma that causes them some sort of conflict and you you will need to not turn a blind eye to the truth okay remember to uh, really dig deep before you jump into giving anybody some sort of decision because you know there could be a false beginning here all right there is a new door opening for you. You get to choose wherever you're going and, and you do have the power to be successful in whatever you do. So Gemini, I feel as though you are embarking on a new journey and you have the power to succeed as long as you don't let anybody come in. And confuse you okay because this is confusion somebody could come in and make you confused this is what's gonna happen you are going to have somebody that comes in and and, and tries to shake up your foundation this is what's gonna happen so just keep that in mind you probably will be presented with some sort of dilemma but you have the knowledge and the power to prevail okay I see no fear here no fear you guys can do anything your self-esteem and your confidence and your inner power Is, uh, is right where it needs to be. It's, you're at the top of your game. And that's when the universe throws in somebody to shake you up. When you are at the top of your game, they will throw you a curveball, and you are going to be thrown a curveball. Okay? So just choose wisely. Beware that there is some, some somebody coming in that is going to cause some confusion and mental conflict. Think twice before letting them in. And that's what I have, Gemini. I wish you the best. You got it. You have got this. Talk to you later. It's all about the choices and decisions that you make, right? But you know, your self-esteem and your self-confidence and your inner power knows exactly what to do.